Oh, look, a satanic... Well, it's not a satanic pentagram, but still. Oh, okay. Oh, no! <laughs> I think I just realized something. Hmm. The you skeletons want to recruit gold into the skeleton army! Oh, that too. <laughs> Oddly specific, but okay. I the th the problem is I can't really go more into it because it involves a lot of swear words. Yeah, because YouTube is spineless. Yeah. Yes, unfortunately. So we'll figure a solution for out later. Just for the meantime, let's just do this to the yes. solution. A burn scroll. The skeleton war, fudge boy. No way. <laughs> oh yeah, I need to get that sh System Shock remake that just released recently. Hmm? Delicious. <sighs> There's so many games coming out that I need to play. And it's just There's... like, Resident Evil 4, Tears of the Kingdom, of course, is the one I've been wanting to play the most, but I'm just like... Mm. $70, <laughs> man. $70. I know. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I, oh, I want to be the clown. Oh, I want to be the clown. Apparently, though, I'm hearing that uh, the the higher price of gaming is actually backfiring in a way. Uh, Chopper. Good. Good. Because, like, oh my god! During inflation. And yeah, this price is a real steal. Well, you got that right. Screw, screw you. Screw you. 5,000 meats? Tell me about the games. Tell me about Barnaby Bob. Tell me about the games. Since we stopped What's turning on, tell me more about the games. Tell we me got about some the... of them. Okay. Tell me about the popcorn. Sarah Perilla. What? Sarsaparilla. 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 Oh, so the R is uh, the R is silent. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's probably French or something. Sarsaparilla. Mm -hmm. No, it's Google like an old tiny, uh, uh, You think of like old time prospectors drinking it and stuff in the old west or something. So basically, right, kind of like dang damn it, I'm gonna go and drink that old sarsaparilla. <laughs> I'll tell you. Uh, let me tell you, he does this amazing song where he gets a volunteer from an audience up on the stage and throws knives at him. He never misses his target. Did you leave at the part where he puts an apple on their head or something? Oh, for sure. Oh, wow. You aren't very good at job gonna selling me out this. No, he does a terrible job at it. I mean, I'm sick of being played for a fool. You think I'm going to sell out that much meat just to dive into this? You've got another thing coming. Are you going to give me a ticket or am I going to punch you? Oh! Oh. oh! You think you're a real tough cookie, huh? <laughs> Listen here, bucko! All I have to do is shout. And you're our new shot show exhibit. We'll call it the amazing crybaby little censor word. But hey, it'll but get hit. you in for free. How does that plan grab you? Y'all are a bunch of buttheads. <laughs> I like that clown. <laughs> Like, I already need 5,000 meat assists to buy, like, a crate of dynamite. So, what are we supposed to do now? <laughs> well, first of which is I need a giant crate of dynamite in order to, like, uh, help with the, uh, help with this, uh, train track here, but it's blocked off. I need to get you know, some just... of those, uh, locksmiths. I don't know where to find them. You know, I just realized... What? Mm -hmm. If meat's a currency in this world, <laughs> what happens if the meat goes bad? <laughs> I don't know if you're gonna like run the risk of hurting your brain trying to think that through or what. Uh, I'm <laughs> thinking. <laughs> don't hurt your brain, Riza, please. Oh, or is that much up there? So it's not a lot of hurt. No, but oh, still, it should Jesus hurt. It's golden. gonna think. Yes, Riley. What do you think of that Pac-Man Lego set that was just announced? Eh. That's why? Funny. Why really? Pac-Man? Why not? I think it's cool. I mean, and I well, still uh, want the Transformers Optimus Prime one. Out of all the Lego sets, why Pac-Man? 
There's already like um, the big ass, or yeah, big ass uh, Bowser one. That one's pretty cool looking too. I can't say I hold with breaking the looting fellas place. Hmm. See if I can find it. Ah, here it is. <laughs> oh, Golden. Yes, Riley? Have you ever played the Spyro games? No. Would you be interested in playing them? Maybe. Hmm. I might. Their own, the trilogy's on sale on Steam for like 10 bucks. Spyro! Yeah, I'm actually I'm actually currently playing it on my own. Um, the Revolt Spyro Roots. Ray Ray Trilogy. Right. The it's, only thing it's... I ever hated about those things were the speedways. Those games. Yeah. Well, logic would have been really disgusted after what I just did. What'd you do? I went through another bull spit. Ew. <laughs> Alright. I'm not paying that much for that Lego set, but it's pretty cool. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. 270 bucks. It's like the same <laughs> as the freaking Bowser one, too. I think I remember Golden, like, in the very first episode, like, he was pretty disgusted when you did that. I mean, yeah. Yay? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you're back. You're okay. <laughs> Your horse noises, I swear. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having fun with it, so. I can tell. <laughs> oh my god. Who's bothered me? Getting... Really? A cow? Another cow. cow. Kill, the, kill the cow. Kill the cow for me. It's still weird to me oh. how there's a Seinfeld... Uh... How like in the said. world did that yeah. kill in one hit? It just happened. Well, I made it from uh, that that one Smith place. Uh, the Smiths. That one person looks very angry walking underneath. La 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 la, yeah, yeah. What? It's a Smith song. Oh. Out of my way, Missy. She looks mm. very upset. Oh yeah, Golden. Yes. They announced a new Hot Wheels game. Oh god. Why? The last one was pretty cool. Okay. Just why? Because it's not bad. Uh. Oh, there's no locksmiths in here. Damn it. Oh no. I sure do enjoy my job. I feel like we're at the point where we're just going in circles and we don't know what to do. Yep, time to look up a walkthrough or something along those lines. <laughs> List of loathing. Where can I find... Out of three books you receive, if you do not receive from your mother, it will be available from either but, uh, Button Willow Store for 1500 Redwood. Good lord, everything is expensive. <laughs> I'm buying Spyro right now, so I'll have it. Button Willow. I, I have Spyro on the PS4, which is fun, but I haven't played it recently. I don't know if you like playing bloody games, but have you ever played Parasite Eve on PS1 as a kid? I did not grow up with the PlayStation 1. I grew up with the uh, Nintendo 64. I had both, but I primarily played them in PS1 because I had memory cards for it. I used to have a grudge with uh, Sony because of the competitive nature between them and Nintendo. Yeah. Hmm. But nowadays, it's kind of uh, turned it on its head. Yeah, it's more than Sony versus Microsoft and instead of like between them and Nintendo. Yeah. Like, Nintendo and Nintendo is just there. Thing. Yeah, they're I mean, ruining Nintendo them. is just a bunch of jerks. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, Microsoft and Sony have their own things where it's like different. Like the fact that Microsoft is so much has so much backwards compatibility with their games now. And then you got Sony who doesn't want to do backwards compatibility with their newer consoles. It would be nice if they would re-release some of their older games into collections. You All know. games don't sell, according to what they say. Yeah, it's like the thing with my with Sony especially. Like Nintendo's bad too, but Sony just 
I would like a re-release of the God of War games, thank you. The original trilogy. Like, that would be nice, or any of your other properties that you had back in the day, re-releases of those. I think they're holding out for a special occasion, and honestly, I can be, I will be able to bet during, like, God of War's, like, 20th anniversary or something, that's when they'll do it. I, I really still hope that the new, uh, TV series makes Twisted Metal a thing again. That was my jam back in the day. I, I never cared for Twisted mm-hmm. Metal. I, I would like it. them to like re-release um, Enter the Dragonfly. I want them to re-release it. Oh, that was my favorite power game. I used to play it even on the Even with all the even with all its glitches and stuff. Yeah, that was my favorite. That's But when I was a kid so though, so much it, of the game to look around. Jeez. When when I was a kid though, I didn't acknowledge the glitches. I I played I just thought it was part of the game, and... so I just still played it. I beat all three original games and I played like 30 minutes of that and could not could not uh, no actually maybe I played about two hours and then I just couldn't do then, it um, and I want to say back in 2016 uh, two of my friends and I we wanted to play the three the big three PlayStation mascots um, he one of them got Sly Cooper other one got Jack and Daxter hmm. and also um Ratchet and Clank. Oh, I love Ratchet and Clank. I'm and so then I got And I chose Spyro. But I was an extra... For, I was wanting to do the extra... Because the only, we only had to play like the like the trilogies. But I was like, no, I want to play all of them. So I bought all... I had all the cop. I have actually have all the games in my room right now. I have Enter the Dragonfly, Hero's Tale, and Turtle Knights, Dawn of the Dragon... I still some of my old PS1 games. Treasure Cave, Y'all are... this door is remaining locked at all times. Sadly, the door is locked. Y'all ever heard of a game called Brave Fencer Musashi? Nope. I have it. <laughs> Never heard and... of it. Oh, but back on uh, Wretch and Clank was my jam on PS2. That was honestly the game that really convinced me to get a PS2. Hmm. So... I didn't know this until recently. I own one of the most expensive GameCube games on the market. Uh, gotcha Force. Of course it's Gotcha Force. Of course it's something Weep related. I knew it. Do what? I knew it was going to be Weep related. It's Capcom. Still. Good to see Last you. time I checked the price. Hold on. Five piles of scrap. I'm so hyped for uh, the new Ratchet and Clank game being released on Steam. I haven't played yeah, it, I've been wanting to. I think Logic just told me about that today. He's like very excited that he, that it's gonna come to Steam, and I'm like, okay. Oh, nice. Like, really actually buddy, get out of here. Stop it. I think I mostly I mostly say that because like I can't play it anyways on my Steam, so I'm like, okay. Stab it. Yeah, because of your specs and all that. No, not just that. It's, it's not compatible with my with my Mac at all. Yeah, that's what I mean. <laughs> so. On Amazon, it's going for nine hundred dollars. Jeez. I wonder how much Brave Fencer Musashi Mush- uh, Musashi uh. is. <laughs> eh, Wait, never, hold never on mind. a second. So if I sell a pickaxe, it's only ten percent of the actual price here. If you sell a pickaxe, pickaxe, I, I cannot speak. Pickaxe. Pick it your ass. <laughs> pickaxe. Pickaxe. What a pick in your axe. <laughs> Riley, are you having a hard time speaking tonight? <laughs> no. What in the world is my mom watching? I'm watching something really loud out there. What the heck? So a lot of people are thinking because um, Nintendo took down the uh, 
DOF emulator off Steam. They're hinting a uh, GameCube emulator. Dolphin. Huh? Do I really yeah. want to go through that? No. Because, like... I don't think they're going to release on PC or anything, if that's what you're well, saying. Well, no, because... Well, the thing they're going to do, they're going to do it and on the Switch. But the thing about it is, is, like... No. The problem I... with it was, it wasn't even, like, Dolphin Emulator as was the issue. It was Valve that had an issue, it had a problem. So, like... They send the DMC. This, this is useless. Takedown notice. Yeah, I know. It's... Yeah, they sent that to Val, not to the people that developed Dolphin, because Dolphin was fine. It's just something that Val did, but it screwed it up. Yeah, like it was audacious of them to even apply for Steam, honestly, as an emulator. So, see, I don't know if, how that works. I assumed Val was the one that asked them because they're the one that got in trouble for it. Maybe they were applying, and that's why there was like a quarter, and they had to iron out everything. But Nintendo sent to sent to see to uh, sent to cease and desist. C&D. Well, I mean that's the thing though, because like, hold on, Hunger Box actually Hunger Box did a video on it. I didn't watch it yet. It's, I want. Uh, and it explains like, why. I, I got... It's so sad, but at the same time, I'm not surprised. But I have my Steam Deck now, so I want to try and see about getting that working, anyways. But. What was they talking about? <laughs> okay, she's watching Love Boat. Oh my gosh, what the heck! Love Boat, huh? My dad my likes mom, to watch Mash. My mom, my mom, my mom's been obsessed with Love Boat recently. So, I. <laughs> oh my gosh! But yeah, I'm pretty sure. That, um, my understanding of it, like I said, I haven't watched the video yet, but I think it was there's a there was a file that the emulator had and that's what the big issue was because they can't do anything to the emulator but like oh, there was God. something that fouled um evil cows okay flip heartless riley in the background kingdom hearts reference i'm still waiting for news on kh4 but We're I not gonna get that for another like twenty years, Riley. You know that. I know. I know. Oh God! Know. Don't 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 kill him! Don't kill! Oh come on! I'm oh. Waiting, but I'm not expecting it anytime soon. You know? I'm not either. The referencing the Kingdom Hearts all only makes me think of when Super iPad Wolf did in the Undertale video, and then halfway through he just goes, "Oh my God! I really? The Kingdom Hearts fan. Really? Only two HP? Oh dear." Oh dear. Them cows, oh. man. Cows are violent. Yes, they are. You ever, you ever played Diablo Wait, is Street Fighter 6 out now?